All right, everybody, welcome. My name is Kevin Jones, and this is the Beginning Hunter video series here on YouTube. Uh, my goal with this program is to educate you and inspire you and inform you on everything you're going to need to know about uh, being a hunter and a successful hunter at that. Um, so this will be um, a really quick thing. I'm going to be talking about Onyx Hunt, uh, about how you can utilize their software and um, their mapping systems. So this is going to be for my iPhone here at my house. Um, I literally just sat down and did this. First thing you're going to want to do is you're going to want to scroll down to an off-grid off -grid area. And that's all you got to do. You literally just have to hit the off-grid button. And it's going to ask you to name your section of the map. Um, I'm just going to go ahead and choose something easy like hunting spot, like part one. So I'll just type that in here. I'm going to hit done. And then it gives you the resolution detail. How much resolution do you want? I always go with the 10 miles wide. If you hit 5 miles, you get in really close. This is 10. If you go to 150 miles, you're getting really low resolution. So again, I always use 10, and that's all you got to do. You hit save, and you go back to the off-grid tab on your Onyx. Again, this is from my iPhone. And you scroll down to the bottom of your saved offline maps, and you can see that it's starting to cook it, right? It's making your map. So the one with the spinning wheel right there, uh, it's processing your map. Basically what it's doing is it's, um, you're, you're telling on X that you are going to want to use this map when you are offline, when you are off grid, when you do not have cell phone service. I talk to a lot of guys that have on X. They know how to use it when they have service, but there's a whole, the, the best use that you can find from on X is when you don't have service. Essentially what you're doing is you're telling on X to save this chunk, this 10 mile um, chunk of land to your to your program so that way you can use it when you don't have cell phone service like literally you're walking around in airplane mode and you will be able to use your iPhone as a GPS with all the resolution that you would normally have as if you had um, as if you actually had service so again this is for you to use when you do not have service I can't stress that enough the whole point of on X at least for me, I mean, it's great if I'm in a spot where I have, um, where I have service. But a lot of places that I hunt, especially in the back country here in Oregon, um, there is there is absolutely no cell phone service. Period. And I'm there for over a week, um, so this allows me to use the technology that Onyx brings to the table um, for for good. And again, it's not just like the terrain, but you can also use certain map layers. And I'll go into that in a separate video. But you're able to use um, your map layers to show, okay, am I on private land right now or am I on public land right now? And it allows you to differentiate as you normally would, again, without having service. So when you look back to the bottom right, it uh, is still downloading. You have to be uh, connected to Wi-Fi uh, in order to do this. At least that's been my experience. Um, or you might need to have really quick service. But um, I've had the best luck. As you can see at the top by the Verizon thing, I'm connected to my home's Wi-Fi right now when I was doing this. Um, so it rips through pretty good. I um, usually save a lot more terrain and areas than I think I will actually need. Um, I was bow hunting in southern Oregon for antelope uh, this last summer, and I saved the entire unit on my map because I'd never been there. I wanted to have the ability to uh, change positions and uh, change locations on the fly, and it allowed me to do that. So you can see it is now finishing up the downloading and you'll see this green square just popped up, right? So if you, uh, yeah, it'll, it'll tell you, okay, so that one was, okay, so right here. So you see this big green square? That is all of the saved maps that are now on your phone. So you can go offline and, uh, and you will still have everything within that square. If you wanted to save the chunk next to it, you literally just do the same process again. You click uh, the off-grid and you toggle around. You try to line up the squares, your next square with your previous square. It'll ask you to change the name and this will be hunting spot part two. We're not going to do that because it's essentially just the same thing we just did. But that gives you a great idea of how to actually do this. So again, this is for off-use or for offline use. You now can test it by... Uh, hitting the offline button it's essentially put your onyx maps in airplane mode but um you know since i still have wi-fi i'm still connected um another way to do it is when you uh, go up on your iphone you hit airplane mode boop right there and 
if I actually didn't have any service, it would give me all the detail in this entire section. So all this information would still be there. So if you guys liked what you saw on this, if this was helpful, drop me a comment, leave me a message. If it sucked, tell me. If it was useful, tell me. Um, we'll see you next time. Thanks.